I need to know what is one thing that every Fashion Week virgin should know? Ooh, um, wear comfortable shoes, I guess, but it's also fashion, so that doesn't really matter. But I think I made it work today with like a platform, oh. so the, the front is as high like as the back. Absolutely. And so that helps to just kind of get you through the day if you're going from show to show. I love that Not tip. Feel like your feet are gonna break off. Okay, wait, speaking of platforms though, they are extremely comfortable, but that means the 2000s are officially coming back. They are making a comeback. So, what? trend do you not want to see happen? Oh, um, low-rise jeans. <laughs> I feel like we can all I, say that. Seriously, someone the other day was like, are we going to bring back, do you remember when you would, well, I'm older than you, but like, we would cut the, the jeans, like, below the button, so you would cut it with, like, a scissor, and then it would have, like, a fray all around, and now I'm like, listen, I have a kid, I want my jeans to come up to here. If they bring them back down, I can't. Like, no. I'm not going back. No. I'm not. So that that's a hard no. Well, we have to shout out to our stylist, Brian. Who out. always makes us look so great. If Brian came to us yes. with a bunch of low-rise jeans, would we match or would we say absolutely not? I mean, I'd say, like, I'll wear them at home if I we, like, have a bottle of wine at home. We like, like, a cute girls' night in. A girls' yes. night in. Okay, totally. Totally, totally, totally acceptable. Otherwise, I can't leave the house like that. Absolutely not. not. No. I mean, I'll try it, yeah. but I'll probably take them off within 20 minutes. I mean, I'm sure they're comfortable because nothing's, like, pressing in. <laughs> right? Yes. Absolutely. That's true. That's a good point. There's so many amazing shows yeah. with a lot of amazing fashion trends. So I need to know, what show are you watching right now? Which trends that you kind of want to follow? I mean, what am I not watching? But I'm embarrassed to say what? that I just finished. I, I watched all of Too Hot to Handle in like 48 hours. And then I spend my time afterwards Googling like, are Bo and Harry still together? <laughs> like I literally, and then after like every single season, I'm like, I need to know if they're together or not. And so are they together? That was, I, it, one said that they were, and then her Instagram said that they, that they were, and then one said that they weren't, so. We're gonna need to investigate. That was the last show that I just watched. Okay. So maybe you're like, especially because it's so cold right now in New York, you're dreaming of warmer weather. Yes. The bikinis. Bikinis. And tan and okay. totally. We're taking a trip to the Hamptons. <laughs> Let's go. Soon. Okay. Let's go. Okay. In that case, we gotta go. We gotta We're going go. to the Hamptons now. <laughs> okay, so what is one of the most iconic looks from a character that you've played? Oh man, I, th I definitely think that from Scream Queens, Hester's neck brace was pretty iconic, but so were Rachel Berry's knee highs and like penny loafers. Love, Love the and knee like, highs and penny loafers. Sweatshirts, sweaters with animals on them. So there were a lot of Halloween costumes. I love that. After that. Did <laughs> you didn't take any of those costumes home? I took home from Scream Queens this amazing vintage Chanel sarong that I wore in a scene where I was kissing John Stamos. So, so that's now framed in your room. <laughs> I actually like use it. That they, they told me I could take it home and I would like I wear it all the time on the beach. I'm like, this is gorgeous. Oh my god.